Hey everybody, do you play Mega Man Maker on multiple computers? If so, this is the video for you. I will tell you how to synchronize your Mega Man Maker levels between multiple computers. Mega Man Maker stores its local levels in the user's folder App Data, Local, and then Mega Man Maker. That is the folder that we need to synchronize with the other PC. The program that I will be using is called SyncThing and it's free and open source. It runs on both PCs and it synchronizes a folder between them without saving it to any cloud storage service first. I'll synchronize my personal Mega Maker folder between my main PC running Fedora 38 and this laptop running Windows 8. On Linux, the installing process is just as simple as installing through the package manager So let me instead show you the Windows download process. You just go to synthing.net slash downloads and choose the correct version for your OS. On Windows you should download the Sync Tracer version of the program instead so that you can easily manage it. After that you just follow the installation process. It should then open and ask you to give it firewall permissions. If you don't do that this will not work. You can now explore the interface. If you installed the base version instead of the sync tracer, you would then have to access this interface through a web browser. On top, it reminds you to add a password for the interface. Feel free to do that. Now we need to add our other device, in this case it being my PC. For that, you will need the unique code that represents your other PC. On that PC you can go to Actions, Show ID and copy that key and paste it to the Device ID input field. Or if the other PC detects it, you can just click the correct one from the list. You can then name it and click Save. Your computers are now connected, but there is no folder to synchronize. To do that, all you will need is to click Add Folder on any of the two computers and tell it a name for the share and a path to where you want it to be. In our case, that will be C, Users, Timothy, App Data, Local, Mega Maker. Remember that App Data is a hidden folder, so you may need to type it manually in the file explorer. Then, before clicking save, go to the sharing tab and toggle to what machines you want it to synchronize to. And also, activate the simple file version. If you want it to just sync to one PC to another and not the both ways, you can change the folder type to receive only or send only. I will leave it to send and receive. You can now click save but there is one more step before this actually works. If you now go to the interface of the other computers, you will see that a new alert has appeared. It is asking you to accept the share. We will just click add and tell it where on this computer to sync. I will save it on the desktop for now. Remember to add a simple file version in here as well. Better to be safe than sorry. After that, just click save and watch it go. Now, every new level you add or any level you modify on any of these two computers will be the same. Let's test it. I'll duplicate this level right here. Let's see if it magically appears on the laptop. Oh, there it goes. Now you will never have to be copying level files between computers. Just remember to only work on one PC at a time and make sure that it is synchronized with your latest copy. Thank you for watching! Synchronize your thoughts to the comments below or subscribe for more videos like this. Bye!